Wahlberg out of USMMA. And look at the tail of the tape. Both of these guys are almost the same age. Eddie's 25, Danny 23, both 5'11". Both weighed in at 145, and both have a reach of 71 inches, so pretty much even across the board here. Yeah, we're not gonna make any uh, Wahlberg jokes, are we? Or no, no Marky Mark, Wahlberg, Wahlbergers. Is he related to him? I don't, I don't know. know. I don't know. I mean, he's down at uh, USMMA, I think, yeah. is in Framingham. Yeah, Be Bellingham, Mass. Oh, Bellingham. Bellingham, Mass. Yeah, he's got some great teammates around him. Hillary Rose, Shane yep. Doherty, Ruben Ray. And he's 1-0, Cage Titans 51, a split win over Philip Losigno. And he had uh, his original opponent here tonight was supposed to be Johnny Milligan. And Eddie Pena's original opponent was supposed to be Avery Poole. So NEF was very fortunate to save uh, these two uh, and, and match them both together to, to keep fighting. So Yeah, uh, USMMA has been a, kind of a, a great staple in the uh the MMA community in the Northeast. Uh, Tom Habers, I believe it is, runs that school and he does a great job there. Well, here comes Eddie Pena, Danny Wahlberg in the cage right now. Pena looking dialed in and focused, yeah. ready to make his debut. Looks a little like Mo Kanani, doesn't he? A little bit. His build, you know, that yeah. kind of like really ripped, big shoulders. I talked to Primo before the event started. He told me, got to give a shout out to Maple Ave in North Carolina. Anyone that's out there watching the stream will know what I'm talking about. All right, Pena out of the red corner with the black trunks, Wahlberg out of the blue corner with the red trunks. I'm guessing Pena comes out with some really good kick. He looks like a Muay Thai fighter kind of build. <laughs> So he, he's a southpaw, and uh, Primo told me he's a good boxer. Yeah. He's got a really nice jab. He's got good footwork. So I think he wants to keep this fight on the feet, and that's what they're doing right now. Wow. And Wahlberg just hit him with a right, a head kick. But he's firing back. They're just standing toe-to-toe, -to -toe, duking it out right now. Wow. Pena from El Salvador moved here when he was six years old. He's been training that Vision Quest Muay Thai for quite some time now, and this is a debut that I know I, I've talked to Ryan Sanders, and he's very high on Eddie Pena, and by the yeah. looks of it right now, I can see why. Wahlberg in trouble. But he's firing back. He's got, a, he's got the closed guard up, and I think John English is letting it go because he's not really on another right head kick. It's a little bit slower. Pena, Pena's getting through. Payne is throwing about 75 strikes already. Yeah. He's just been nonstop. I think it's more than that, man. He's just firing. Both of these guys showing some good toughness and a nice chin in there because both of them have landed some big shots, but now Payne yeah. has Wahlberg hurt. He's turtling up. I think this could be the beginning of the end. He landed a knee. He's going to stop. Oh, that's going to do it. John English. No, he's letting it go. Those knees are starting to hurt. Wow, I thought John was going to stop I, it there. I thought for sure he was going to stop it right he there. He was standing up, kind of a standing up turtle. Pena just teeing off on Wahlberg right now. Wahlberg is, he hasn't been throwing much of anything. He's just been trying to hang in there, and Pena just keeps coming forward. There's a definite speed disparity. Wahlberg's a lot slower. Oh, Pena big jab quicker. right there. Pena hurt him. Wahlberg going back to the kicks. Two, three, and then the hips. And he's that down to the court. Wow. Monster takedown. Monster that, takedown right there for Wahlberg because he needed to get this yeah, off of the feet. Yeah, he definitely. And how much has Eddie Pena spent? How much energy has he spent? Oh my God, he looks like this might, oh my God. No, he's not, he's not under the chin. Oh, he taps. He taps. What 
a crazy turn of events.